I've been working in the office all day. It's definitely time to get outside. So I brought my slack line. And while this is great active rest and a good balance challenge, I don't really consider it to be training. Now there are some things that I do in my training that help slack line. First off, you wanna be really good at balancing on one foot in a variety of situations. If you can do pistol squats, you are already several steps ahead. So it's kind of fun. You can do whatever you need to do. The other thing you can do from body weight is kind of that one-legged deadlift. This has other names and other systems. I don't know what they are or I'll mess them up. So you can put your arms out in front. It's a little bit more difficult. You can put them straight down. You don't want to crane your neck too much. I like to do it this way. I'll show you what it looks like from the side. going to help you out a lot working on the slack line. The other thing, if you're into kettlebells, the one leg deadlift is absolute slack line gold. And it's basically the same movement we were doing before. So I'm going to put it in the opposite leg of the leg that's moving. Okay. You can do it either way. So just those ideas will help a lot with your slack lining. Anytime also um, you're doing one-sided work, that's going to help you get that core stability that's really required for the slack line. Now don't freak out, it doesn't require a lot. It requires some, but if you're regularly training with kettlebells or with convict conditioning, PCC, SCC style things, chances are you've got enough. So we just, you just want to have more than average. You know what, it's time to slack line. This is my first walk of the day, so you can probably see me fall all over the place. Gotta get warmed up for that one. So I think those drills actually really helped me. That's uh, better than normal um, for my first walk of the day. So I hope if you haven't already tried slacklining, to give it a shot, especially if you're already doing kettlebell training and or calisthenics. You'll see they support each other and they're a whole lot of fun to use together.
I'm Adrienne Hardy of GearyGirl.com, and I really hope you've been enjoying my videos. You might have noticed that I don't use third-party ads. If you'd still like to support my channel, and I hope that you do, you can do so by visiting my website at GearyGirl.com. That's G-I-R-Y-A-G-I-R-L dot com. I only review things that I like and think that will help you. Subscribe to the channel and check out some of those items as well as my website. I appreciate you watching and I hope I can create more cool things that you'll enjoy.